What's going on, PokéFam? It's PokéDiz coming at you once again. And today we are out once again hunt for Pokemon cards. It's Friday, Saturday for you guys, but restock day is usually Friday for us here. But Past Diz has something to show you guys. Walmart actually restocked on Thursday. So we did find some awesome stuff yesterday, and I'm going to show y'all that right now. Well, y'all, we definitely came into Walmart at the right time. I just got off work. It's Thursday right now, day before hunting, and we definitely hit the mother load right here. Look at all these league decks. That's pretty cool. I'm so tempted to get another one of those but guys we got the best pool we could ever ask for in our last video from that so i think i'm gonna pass on those and leave those for somebody else i mean so many battle styles packs that's absolutely crazy and they even have the etbs here so awesome well we're definitely gonna get one of those shining fates tins for sure well they got this maximum gold from Yu-Gi-Oh. that's pretty cool so i'm thinking this tin and then a few of these battle styles packs too why not all right so now that we got our guaranteed stuff today let's go see if they have anything else in the back well no change back here still the same situation we have in in the back those are mine actually but we still got that pikachu looks like one of them was sold well it definitely was restock day we actually snagged up that shining fates 10 as well as four of those battle styles packs just to leave a bunch for everybody else obviously you guys saw how many packs they had there and we left those two galarian rapidashes for somebody else because like i said we got the best pull i could ever ask for out of our box in our last video so i'm so glad that we actually stopped by here day before restock day i'm definitely going to work this into our video and just make sure that you guys saw that walmart is definitely still selling pokemon cards so what a crazy amount of packs that were in there those battle styles packs were absolutely insane how many were there at least 100 and the shining fates tens and battle styles etbs absolutely crazy so we're actually back at that walmart they probably don't have much left in the big stuff but i guarantee you they got some battle styles packs left i hope everyone is having a wonderful day today let's go see what they got left so they got the league battle deck still i really do like those those are actually pretty cool looking they still got quite a few of those battle styles packs left guys as you can see, still a lot here. I love that. I got some of those third-party companies. Don't want those. And a Maxim Gold. Very cool. And a Legendary Kaiba Collection. That's interesting. Well, surprise, surprise, that other Shining Face 10 did not survive the rest of Thursday. But that's okay. They still had a bunch of Battle Styles left, which is absolutely amazing. The ETBs for Battle Styles did not survive either. Not surprised. As well as the new Structure Decks with the Inteleon. I actually kind of dig that. I do like Inteleon. I may pick up one of those one day when we're out hunting if i can't find anything else but let's go ahead head to our next stop i'm thinking that we actually check out a game store that is semi near me we have never been there before cannot wait to see if they have anything awesome for us they always have some cool DD stuff as well as some card games but let's see if they now carry pokemon so the game store does not open for a few more minutes but we got a walmart right nearby and we're gonna see what they got here are the card section they got a bunch of battle styles packs here too guys and some big teeny v's very nice i think we'll get like two of these and then they got some more stuff over there looks like they got some of those league battle decks as well and some third party stuff so that's pretty cool so let's see if they have anything in the back they usually don't in this walmart but we'll see y'all i'm pretty sure i'm totally picking up these today this is why you always check walmart because they got some really awesome stuff well i'm looking and looking but i'm not seeing any pokemon products in the back at all oh wait i found them sort of hmm not really but that's okay. Still glad we walked back here or we wouldn't have found these awesome socks. Well, it looks like every Walmart in my area got a lot of these Battle Styles packs. I think they all came in like cardboard boxes. I have no idea. But we ended up snagging two of these today. Left so many more for obviously everybody else. And then we snagged up those socks that I'm super excited about. And we are finally here at Game Theory. So let's go see what they have in there. So guys, Game Theory is absolutely stacked. You see what is up there? They got Battle Styles booster boxes here, guys. I did talk to them. Price is so so reasonable i am gonna pass on it today because you guys know i basically opened like three of those in single packs but they also do have some of the partner packs too here it's absolutely amazing still priced at retail so just a fantastic store and as you can see there's some top loaders down there and i 100 needed some of those so i grabbed some of those today for sure rise of red skull very cool i love all the dnd figures in here they have so many you can basically choose any character you want paint them up and play dnd dnd is a really fun game guys if y'all have not tried it, it is definitely something to check out at least once in your life i love these little battle style stands I hope I can get one of these someday. Well, Game Theory was absolutely stacked. That was amazing to see. I did grab a few of those sleeves as well as some top loaders because the Diz definitely needed some more of those. As well as we finally saw the first ever booster box 
out in the wild, which was absolutely amazing. We actually did pre-order the Chilling Rain booster box. There's a long line for it, so we hope that we are able to pick that up when it comes out. If not, we're still going to find some ETBs or packs out in the wild, kind of like we did with Battle Styles. Considering that I have opened like almost a hundred packs of Battle Styles, I did pass on the booster boxes, but guys, it was absolutely amazing to actually see that in the wild. We're off to our next stop. Let's see if we can find some other stuff in the wild today. We're at our next stop, and thank Thankfully, it was pretty close to game theory. We got a Walgreens. Let's see what they got in there. And we got no Pokemon stuff in here today. But we do got some magic, which is pretty cool. We got some Yugi structure decks too. For a second, I thought this was a Piplup and I totally would have gotten it. Well, surprise, surprise, nothing in that Walgreens. Let's go ahead, head to our next stop though. See what we can find. We're at our next stop. We're gonna make it at Barnes and Nobles this time. Let's see what they got in there. I always love coming to Barnes and Nobles because they got so much cool stuff. I really want that. Look at all these plushies, Harry Potter style. That's pretty cool. Neo blocks, those are interesting. Oh, and a little Pikachu. These are pretty cool. I really do like that too. Oh. Very, very nice. Well, that Barnes and Nobles did not look as stocked as the last one that we went into on our previous video. It's okay though. They did have some V-Dex behind the counter. I didn't get any filming done right there because it was so busy at the counter. There was a lot of sound, but we're gonna go ahead, head to our next stop, see what we can find. We're at our next stop. We're gonna make it a party city. Let's see if they got something in there for us. This place is awesome. Look at all the party supplies they got up in here. Ooh, man, this place is stacked. Ooh, we got the Pokemon party stuff. Very, very cool. I love all this stuff. Look at the little buckets. Those are nice. Oh, this is so, so awesome. I'm just saying, I may have a Pokemon party on my next birthday. It could happen. And we got some pops over here. Gotta love that too. Oh, somehow that ponytail is backwards. That's the right way. We got a Mew here though, that's cool. Well, no Pokemon cards in there, Sally. They did have all that awesome party stuff for Pokemon, but no cards. I know I've seen somebody find some packs in Party City, so we're gonna keep trying, obviously. I didn't even see like a UPC label or anything like that, pricing tag, anything like that that said Pokemon cards in that store, but that's okay. We're gonna go ahead, head to our next stop, see what we can find. We're our next stop, and since we're in the area, we're gonna check out another Walmart to see if they got as much restock as the other two you know we always gotta check out the collectibles. Let's see what we got going on over here. Ooh, Billy the Butcher. Ooh, that's nice. Mr. Sinister. Very, very cool. I've yet to see this pop out in the wild. Ooh, but it is damaged pretty bad, guys. I don't think I'm gonna pick this one up today. Even though I do love Mr. Sinister from X-Men, I usually like the boxes to be in a little bit better shape. We do have little Dobby with his best friend, Harry Potter. Bob Ross, that's awesome. Ooh, we actually have that group. It is really, really cool. Well, I found where all the Pokemon stuff would be. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I used to hunt in this area a lot before I moved, and I'm kind of glad that I moved, because there's a lot of scalpers out here, apparently. It's not like the rest of these toys are not stock, guys. I mean, a few of them are kind of understock, but man, nothing Pokemon whatsoever. Now, why would you even create a game that tells you to cheat? Come on, Monopoly, you're better than that. Well, I believe this may be one of the Walmarts that actually stopped getting Pokemon product, or it just got bought out immediately, because there was absolutely nothing of Pokemon in this Walmart. I know Walmart is more of a store-to-store -store decision when selling Pokemon cards right now, but that's okay. We're going to go ahead and head to our next stop, see what we can find. So we're at our next stop, gonna be a CVS, but I'm actually not going in. And let me explain that. We actually came here a few weeks ago, talked with an associate named Brandon. Gonna link his Instagram in the description below because he actually hit me up on Instagram. His Instagram tag is FlipRadar, and he let me know that he found a bunch of dollar packs at Dollar General. He found the two-pack blisters with the Dragonite as well as the Machamp promo cards with a little coin in there as well. And we are meeting him back where we met him before, and I cannot wait to to get those dollar packs. We have yet to find dollar packs in the wild, so I'm absolutely ecstatic about that. Let's go pick them up. All right, so Brandon wasn't feeling too well today, so I'm not gonna actually make him come on camera, but he did come through with all of those Dollar Tree general packs, guys. Look at these things, I love them. With the Dragonite on there, you got a Lycan Rock, very, very cool. And there's one Machamp in here. There's actually 13 of these packs total, so that means that we've got 12 Dragonites and one Machamp. I have an idea that we're gonna 
use those Dragonite promos for another good cause. But I'm so happy that we were finally able to do some dollar pack openings on the channel. But I can't wait anymore. Let's go ahead and head back to the cave. Cannot believe all the stuff that we saw out today in the wild. Walmart restocked huge. So let's go ahead and head back. I'll make it real quick for you. Whoop. <laughs> And we're back in the cave. So when I got home, I got the biggest surprise ever. There was a package sent from the Cardboard Gamble, one of our actual giveaway winners that was sitting in my mailbox, guys. I could not believe this. This is actually the first mail that we have received on the channel and I'm absolutely thrilled. This is this is just insane. I'm like speechless here. I never thought that we would get anything from anyone, to be honest with you. I mean, I create this content because I love Pokemon and I love going out hunting with each and every one of you guys. I do not do it for the gifts. I guarantee you that. But we're definitely going to open this thing up. I have no idea what's in this. So to tell you a little bit about the Cardboard Gamble, they actually won our Yveltal Amazing Rare that we had a few weeks ago. And I actually checked out their channel. They actually have a really fun channel. A lot of sports card openings. It's actually, so the Cardboard Gamble and her son Jack. Jack is absolutely full of energy. He has so much enthusiasm and I love him opening packs. And them two together is just so entertaining. So you guys, I'm going to link their description as well down below so you can go check them out if you're into sports cards as well as they've started to open pokemon packs again so guys go check them out so we're going to save this for the end we're also going to open up those battle styles boosters that you guys saw me get on thursday as well as today we're going to open two of the dollar general packs as well and then we're going to open up our shining fates 10 that we got on thursday restock at walmart too walmart was crazy stocking so thank you guys so much it's going to be a longer video so you guys strap in all right we're going to start out with with our Dragonite and our Machamp promo card packs right here, guys, from Dollar General. I cannot wait to open these. It looks like we got some tag team back there, and I have no idea what that is, so I'm super excited. Let's go ahead and open these up. I'm kind of wondering what that actually is. Is that, is that? Oh, it's a Guardians Rising. Very cool, very, very cool. And an Evolutions, very, very nice. Now I'm curious to see what actually is in the second pack. Before we open up those two, let's see what two packs are in the Machamp pack. Let's see. Let's see. Here we go. We got a tag team. Love it. And a Sun and Moon base set. Okay. I do love that Machamp promo card. That is absolutely amazing. I love the Lycanroc coin too. Very nice. And then we got the Dragonite Hollow. Love it. Love it. Love it. Very, very cool. I'm going to leave those in the sleeves because, you know, we have a lot of those Dragonites. But you guys will be seeing those a lot come the future because we got a lot more of these packs to open. All right. So let's start out with our Sun and Moon, the one that I'm, you know, the least thrilled about. Let's see what we can get in here. So I, this is the first ever dollar pack that I'm opening on this channel, guys. I am so thrilled that you guys are here with me. Let's see if we can get some first pack magic on that one, yeah? Let's see. So I know these don't have any code cards or anything, and the hit is going to be right here in the middle from what I've seen in pack. We got a Sand Dial, we got a Sea Cucumber, and we got a Poison Barb Reverse. Very nice. So that's actually a decent hit if you're going for dollar packs. Let's see. All right, we're going to save the team up and the evolutions for later. Guardians Rising. Let's see what you got. Come on, three pack. Come on, three pack. Let's see what we can do. All right, so we're going to get that out of the way there. We got a card right there. And let's see. We got a Mudbray, Energy, and an Absol Reverse Rare. Wow, very, very nice. I have not opened up hardly any Guardians Rising, so that's pretty cool to actually get a reverse rare Absol out of that. That's pretty awesome. All right, here we go. We got a team up action. I have not opened any team up packs ever. So this is going to be like the first team up cards that I actually see. Here we go. Let's see what we can get. Oh my goodness gracious. That was absolutely amazing that Brandon helped us out and actually let us know about him finding those packs. He didn't charge us much more than retail, guys, which was absolutely so nice of him. So definitely go check him out. His stores and prices are very reasonable. So here we go. We got a little whatever card there. And let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. We got Squirtle. I love that. We got a Kangaskhan. Such awesome artwork. And a Tentacool is going to be in that one. Not too bad. Not too bad. We got Evolutions. Evolutions. You guys know how I love me the Evolution packs, guys. Let's see what we got. Oh, my favorite boy right there, right in the front. We got a Charmander. Very cool. Very cool. Let's see. We'll flip those around. So we got ourselves a Charmander. We got a Hunter. And we got a Wow. We actually got a good hit out of our three pack. We got a Mega Slowbro EX. Wow. Okay. So I do have this card. Obviously, I've opened up a lot of evolutions. But that's actually really cool to get an awesome card 
from four packs. That's really, really awesome. Very nice, so I cannot wait to open the rest of those. Let's go ahead and sleeve this bad boy up. I actually did pick up a lot of new sleeves at the Game Theory, so I have plentiful, plentiful sleeves and the top loaders, finally, because I was getting pretty low on those, too. Here we go. We got our Battle Styles packs here. Let's go ahead and just dive right in. I don't want to make you guys wait too long. Let's go ahead. We got our six Battle Styles packs. Tyranitar on the front, Tyranitar inside. Gotta love it. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. Still looking for that sleepy, sleepy Tyranitar. So let me know in the comments down below hey, if you guys have been able to find some of those Dollar General two card or the two pack uh, blisters because uh, that was really good rates in all honesty. So let's go ahead. Let's start out with a fighting energy because it's battle style. We got a leaf energy. We got a sword and shield burp, a craw dunt. We got a do blade, a little Fomantis action. We got a rim raid. We got a spear row. Got a Pachirisu, a little Cherubi. We got an Octillery Reverse Rare, not bad. And a Jellicent Rare is going to be for that pack. Well, you know what? We pulled way too many of these Jelly Bellies. Put that right down there. Here we go. We got a Rapid Strike Urshifu on the front. We got a Single Strike inside. Let's see what we can get here. Come on. I'm hoping for literally just one V card that I do not have from these Battle Styles packs because they are so rough. Here we go. Code card for you right there. And let's go Fire Energy for this one. Oh, we got an electric. That's okay. Got a little Perugly. We got a Tower of Darkness. We got a Girder. We got a Cherubi again. We got a Lickitung. We got the Lickables. Oop, pulled too many. We got an Esper. We got a Timber. We got that Tapu Bulu is going to be the reverse rare. That's not bad. And a Marowak is going to be the rare from that pack. Well, we are getting a lot of reverse rares, which we actually did in our last Battle Styles opening, too. Here we go. We got an Empoleon artwork on the front. Let me know uh, which of the pack arts brings y'all the best luck. Is it the Empoleon? Is it the Tyranitar? Let me know in the comments below. Let's see, let's go fire energy for this one. Oh, we got a water, exact opposite. Got a little rapid style mustard. We got a Cheryl, a little heat more, a lick a tongue. We got a horsey. We got a little manky action. We got a mawile. We got a fomentus. We got that sizzlepeed. And we got a luxury hollow. Not bad, not bad. With battle styles, you're honestly pretty happy with a hollow at this point. Here we go. We got a Napoleon on the front. We got a rapid strike on the inside. Let's see what we can get. Let's see what we can get. Come on, rapid style. I'm still trying to get that Urshifu V Max, obviously, like everybody else. Uh, but really, that chase card for me will always be the sleepy, sleepy Tyranitar. Let's see. Let's go Steel Energy for this one. Oh, we got a Fire. Should have gone back to Tried and True. Here we go. We got a Rapid Strike Energy, a little Phoebe action. Got a Heat More. We got a Sizzlepeed. Got a Glammy Owl. A little Slow Poke. We got a Yamper. We got a little Murkrow. We got a Bronzor is going to be the reverse. And a Cheryl is going to be the full art in there. Wow. I do not have this card. Oh, she is gorgeous. Another waifu from the Battle Styles. Wow, Battle Styles just slapped me right across the face and made me shut up. Wow, wow, wow. Look at that Cheryl. Absolutely gorgeous card. I'm going to sleeve that up right there. Fantastic. She is so beautiful. I'm going to go ahead and put that right there to the side. Oh, my goodness. Wow, Battle Styles. We actually got something out of there today. Can't believe it. All right, here we go. We got another Battle Styles pack here. That was just nuts. Did not see that coming at all. Wow, Cheryl. Okay. Okay, Battle Styles. Can you give us one more hit out of here? That would be absolutely insane. Out of six packs, I did not even expect anything. Here we go. Let's go Fighting Energy for this one. Oh, we got a Leaf. All right, hey, we got a little Fero. We got an Escape Rope. We got a Carnivine. Oop, pulled too many again. We got a Zubat. Crochet status. I don't want to miss that card. We got a little Remoraid. We got an Onyx. He's sleeping. You got to be really quiet. We got a Mawile. We got a Cherubi. We got that Tower of Waters. And we got a Victory Bell. Is going to be the rare from that pack. I'm still freaking out about that Cheryl over there. Woo! All right, here we go. We got a Tyranitar pack on the front, and we got a Rapid Strike on the inside. Come on. Come on, Urshifu. What can you bring us, buddy? I'm really hoping for maybe one more thing, but in all honesty, with Battle Styles rates, I am just over the moon for that Cheryl. Here we go. We got a code card for you right there. And let's go Fire Energy to end it. Oh, I am not a psychic here, guys. We got a little Grumpig. We got a Girder. A little cat turn action. We got a ball toy. A Timber. We got a little Corefish. We got a Cacnea. 
We got a Mawile. We got an Ore Beetle is going to be the reverse in there. And we got an Embor Hollow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. So two Hollows and a full art from six packs of Battle Styles. Yeah, that's doing pretty good. We are saving our gift that we received from the Cardboard Gamble for last. Thank you so much again, Jack and Mom. I appreciate you guys so much. We're going to dive right into the 10 that we found on Thursday. Let's go ahead and pop this thing open. Cannot wait to open this thing. I'm going to get it away from the microphone so it don't hurt y'all's ears too much. Here we go. We got our Eldegoss is going to be right on the front. I love these promo cards so, so much. Here we go. We got our packs right here. Let's see. Oh, we got two Charizards in there. Let's go ahead and put those right there. And then we got a plethora of others. So here we go. Six packs total. Let's go ahead and pop these things open. It's been a little while since I've opened some Shining Fates, and uh, I have been missing it quite a bit. Let's see if we can complete some more of that binder, because I'm trying to get all the Shinies if I can. But in all honesty, I've gotten pretty much all of the Chase cards that I really want besides the Skyla out of this one. So here we go. We got a code card for you right there. I also would not be mad with the Shiny Ditto V. We already pulled the V Max, which was our second Chase behind that Charizard. But I really want that V. Here we go. Let's go Fire Energy for this one. Oh, Darkness. All righty. We got a little Float Soul. Got a Dartrix. We got a Rotom. Glossifleur. Got a Cacnea. A little Kufan. We got a Buizel. We got a Spinarak. We got an Eldegoss is going to be the reverse. And a Zarude the Rude Dude has come back to the party. Well, Zarude, you're not going to ruin my day. Let's get a little Dragapult pack action going. All right. Let's see if we can open this bad boy up right here. Okay, that was a harder pack to open there. All right, well, throwing the paper all over the place. Here we go. Let's go a little code card for you right there. And let's go Steel Energy for this one, yeah? Oh, we got a Grass. I need to go back to our tried and true. He's got a little Cramorant, Ball Guy. Got a Dartrix, more Pico, more Peco. Got a little Coughing. We got a Glossifleur. We got a Rowlet. We got a Kufant. We got a Rusted Shield as the reverse. And a more Peco as the V. Not a bad V card right there. This is a dupe for me, but I will never be mad about pulling some Vs. We're going to sleeve that up right there. There we go. We got a little more Peco action. Put that right to the front there. We got a Corviknight pack. We got four more packs out of this 10 guys i'm hoping that we get something good out of there but we shall see will battle styles actually beat shining face today let's see let's see if shining face can actually pull out a win here because battle styles is wrecking it right now with that cheryl let's go leaf energy for this one. Oh, we got a water all right we got a little eldegoss we got a gym trainer cramorant spinnerack a little snob sitting on that bench got a rowlet got a horsey we got a more Pico, more Peco. We got a Yanma as the reverse and a Yan Mega as the rare. Alrighty then. He went and evolved on us. We'll put those right over there. All right, Corviknight. Come on, man. This is not a very good 10 as it's coming out right now. Let's see if we can change our luck today with this pack. Let's go Fire Energy for this one, yeah? Oh, we got a little Fighting. Well, we were close. Got a little Team Yeltow. Got a Rusted Shield. Eldegoss. Trap Inch staring at that moon. I always love this card. Got a little coughing. We got that Shinx. Got a little Rowlet again. A Choodle. We got a Luxray Reverse and a Boss's Order as well. All righty. So this has not been the greatest 10 for us. Here we go. Come on, Charizard. What can you bring us, man? Charizard. What can you bring us today? Will you bring us the good card, Mr. Charizard? We shall see. Here we go. We got a code card for you right there. Let me know what the best pull that y'all have gotten in your recent openings from Shining Fates because it's been pretty rough for me in this 10, but we have gotten some awesome stuff as of late. So here we go. Let's go Leaf Energy for this one. Oh, we got an Electric. That's okay. Got a little Gym Trainer. We got a Team Yeltow. Got a Luxio. Eevee. We got a Buizel. Got a Yanma. We got a Trap Pinch. We got that Naked. We got a... Whoa! My God! Wow! Wow! Are you serious? Oh my god, what the heck just happened? No! I wanted one of you guys to get this! Oh my god, as you guys know, I already have one of these, but oh my god! What the heck just happened? What the heck just happened? Let's see what was behind it. No way, a double banger. Oh my god! Crobat VMAX, are you serious right now? Are you actually serious right now? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Got to be real careful with that one. Oh, my goodness. A little shaky after that. Guys, I was not 
expecting that at all. Are you serious? A Charizard out of a Charizard pack. Are you serious right now? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Let me put that right there. Here we go. Last Charizard pack. Oh my God, what just happened? Wow, okay. So Shining Fates definitely 100% taking this win. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm like I'm still a little shaky after that. Wow. Okay, let's go ahead and get this last pack open if we can. Oh my goodness. We still have that mystery thing to open from Cardboard Gamble. This is absolutely amazing. Here we go. We got a code card for you right there. I'm still shaking. Oh, here we go. Let's go fire energy to end the day. Oh, we got a steel. That's okay. A little rusted sword. We got a Luxio. We got a Thwaki. We got a Shinx. We got a coughing. We got a horsey. We got a Grookey. We got a more Pico, more Peco. We got a Snom sitting on that bench again, and a Luxray. So actually, I think the Snom is new for my reverse set, and Luxray definitely isn't new. But oh my goodness gracious, guys, what actually just happened? I'm definitely gonna go ahead and use one of our top loaders that we got to put this bad boy Charizard right in there. Wow, guys, the centering is off a bit on this one, so my first one is actually a little bit nicer to me. I'm not gonna sell all of my Charizards. You know, I'm definitely gonna keep one of each, but wow, 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 guys. I'm still in shock that that just happened. But let's go ahead, we're gonna finish off with our mystery item that we received, our very first subscriber gift from Cardboard Gamble and Jack. You guys are absolutely amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and just open this thing up. Let's see what we got in here. I hope I don't damage anything inside. There we go. Oh my goodness. Wow, wow guys, what a day, what a day. Let's see. Was not expecting any kind of gift from anybody at all. And I cannot believe that this actually came here today. And then we just got blessed with, with that Charizard luck. I mean, my goodness, my goodness. Let's see if I can get this thing open without damaging anything. All right, so it looks like they got some stuff taped up here. Let's see what we got inside here. Let's see what we got. All right, open that up on the side there. Gonna slide that down as well. Let's see what we got. Oh, it looks like we got a pack in here. What did you guys send me? We gotta, we gotta open this thing up. Here we go. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, we got, looks like we got a pack. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's very nice of you. The little Aracuda and a Mewtwo. Oh, did you guys get me a little check lane blister and put it in here for me? That was so nice of you. Oh, what is this? A Bi Sharp? That's cool. That's really cool. What is in this pack? I have to open it. I have to open it. What else is behind this thing? A little Bi Sharp action. That's so cool. And a Zoa Arc. That is very, very nice. Wow, look at those. Look at those hollows. That's so cool. I love these. I do not have either of these. That is absolutely amazing. I'm gonna definitely put these over here. And then we got our little Aracuda. Thank you for the sleeve, I appreciate it. Oh, and there we go. We got a code card for every single one of you guys. Oh, that is so nice. Thank you so much. So let's see what we get in our pack that we got. Oh my goodness, Tyranitar on the pack card. They know me so well. They know me so well. Let's see what we got here, guys. Let's see what we got. Honestly, if there's nothing in here, I am still so, so thankful for the Cardboard Gamble, as well as Jack. You guys are absolutely amazing. Here we go. We got a code card for you right there. Give that one away. And let's go. Let's go fighting energy, yeah? Oh, we got a fire. That's okay. We got a little Spupa action. We got a Gliscor. We got a Bruno. I'm going to go through this one super slow because I enjoy it so much. I've never gotten anything like this. We got a little Shinx action. We got a Gligar. We got a Spoink. It's still too late to be on the street, Spoink. We got a Bronzor. We got that Tepig. He always looks like he's wanting to beat up his evolution. It's so awesome. Here we go. We got a Cacturn is going to be the reverse. And a Steelix is going to be the hollow. That's very, very nice. This is the first Steelix that I've pulled from Battle Style, surprisingly. So, wow. Thank you guys so much. You guys are absolutely amazing. I would have to say, though, besides getting that awesome gift, this guy absolutely took my breath away. Was definitely not seeing that coming. And if you guys don't believe me, that's my original one. That is not a flex at all. Do not think that it is. Because of my edits, that they'll think that I'm like packing packs. And I'm really not. So this was just absolutely out of left field. The Cheryl though, 
from Battle Styles. Absolutely gorgeous card. Well, y'all have a wonderful day. I cannot believe that we pulled Charizard in our last video as well as in this one. Just absolutely blows my mind. Thank you guys so much for being here with me on the hunt. Thank you so much once again, Cardboard Gamble. You guys are absolutely amazing. Jack, you are one of a kind. So go check them out, guys. I'm going to link them down in the description below as well as Flip Radar, who helped us out with finding those dollar packs. We still got a lot more of those to open. Well, y'all have a wonderful day. Make sure that you do go check out some of our previous videos. It should be popping up right there for you. If you want to see us pull the last Charizard, go check that out. And as always, make sure you are subscribed down there. Y'all have a wonderful day. And as always in the cave, from me to you, happy hunting. We got him again!